Hello, I'm Dr. David Clark. Don presented for treatment of multiple open gingival embrasures, or more commonly referred to as black triangles. Don actually traveled from another state after doing an internet search on black triangles. Several articles describing this treatment and a full case description are available online at the BioCare website. I like to place disclosing solution to aid in thorough plaque removal. Use of something like the BioCare Profi Plus instrument is far and away the best method to strip away the biofilm and contaminated cementum. Because the clear mylar is more delicate than a metal strip, you will need to gently separate the teeth to be able to place the matrix. In Don's case, there was no tooth size discrepancy. Therefore, I chose to close each black triangle with two matrices. You will learn to tease the biochro matrix away from the tooth with etch tips, brushes, composite compules, etc. Alternatively, you or your assistant can pull the matrix open with an explorer to get access. Other than the use of the mild spray abrasive, no cutting of the tooth is necessary. Make sure and inject the flowable composite directly into the small pool of bonding resin at the gingival margin to avoid trapping an air bubble. I recommend injecting from both the facial and the palatal. When bonding to etched enamel with the injection molding technique, there is no need to cure the bonding resin before placing the composite. When performing injection molding, the bonding resin, flowable, and paste composites are cured all together instead of curing them individually. These anterior matrices from the pink kit have between 0.5 and 0.75 millimeters of cervical curvature. Use several dry brushes to blot away the excess flowable composite and bonding resin in the gingival sulcus. A brownie point in an electric handpiece at medium speed with water is a minimally invasive way to finish back the composite without unnecessary removal of enamel. BioClear's patented diastema closure matrices, combined with modern composite techniques such as injection molding, have given us a predictable and minimally invasive option to treat black triangles. When you consider that 30% of adults have this problem, you can really begin to appreciate this important advancement in both aesthetic dentistry and guided papilla regeneration. <music>